close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. Guys, then welcome to GSM Smart. And today we're going to bypass the Google verification account on J5 Prime Samsung 2017 model. And uh, it's on 2018 patch, 2018 security patch, uh, you can see. So today we're gonna bypass it. So first of all, what you need to do, you need to connect with your Wi-Fi networks. So I'm gonna connect with my networks and I'm gonna put the password and I'm gonna connect. As I'm connected with the Wi-Fi, I will press next and show you guys it's really logged with the email address or not. Because some guys say you are making fake videos. So I'm just I'm gonna make sure. So to show you that it's locked with a Google verification account on the email address. So this is a very easy method, guys. It's 2018 uh, security patches, and uh, you're gonna bypass without PC and without any other stuff. So as you can see, uh, we can't go next here. We have to verify the email address to get. Uh, bypass so what we're gonna do we're gonna just go back to the Wi-Fi menu and press the home button three times and we have to turn it on talk back enabled spoken feedback so just hold on for a one second or two second it will appear on the screen don't press anything okay as you can see now the talk back is enabled so you just uh, make L L yeah. L sign and it will give you this global contact menu on global contact menu what you have to do you have to press go to the talkback setting talkback setting press two time tap two time when you are on the talkback enabled menu now what you have to do just turn it off the talkbacks talkback disabled just disabled, uh, disable it sorry guys and uh, press three time again and the talk back will uh, talk back will disable from your phone now slide it down and uh, go to the help and feed and help and feed uh, just uh, click on about access uh, switch for android something like that And it will uh, show you one uh, a YouTube video or menu so it's still loading my internet connection is a little bit low so okay this is the video uh, you're gonna play when you're gonna play it's gonna give you two options to share just tap on play and uh, click on share and then click on these three dots and it will take you straight to the YouTube um, uh, on the application YouTube application just uh, press later and then close this video by sliding down and sliding on the left hand corner now here on the search you must write GSM smart GSM smart and search this channel And in this channel, uh, you can see the GSMs for the first channel on, on top. You click on that and click on the videos on GSM Smarts and uh, slide it down. Uh, the video you must find is uh, uh, Mobicell Pure plus Google account FRP bypass. Okay, this will be the logo of the video. You can see nicely. It's 12 minute and 17 second video. Press on that and play this video also you're gonna get this application because I'm gonna download the application to bypass this application this links you're gonna find in the description of the video if you want to download directly you can go to directly to your Chrome's and download it in your phone and uh, also if you want to download here you can download here so first application we need to do is the first number one Google account manager click on that and uh, it will give you the option open in Chrome and internet now select Chrome select Chrome and then it's a accept and continue click on accept and continue now no thanks uh, click on no thanks and uh, it will take you straight to the file menu now press download it's 7.92 megabytes and update the permission click on update then allow 
and then OK and it will start download this file and wait for it until finish the file 7.92 megabytes file accept and continue so while it's all in, uh, downloading we're gonna go back uh, to the YouTube again and download the second application on the on the screen uh, you can see the second link is down there under that uh, the first link you're gonna download that and you're gonna click on that and it will take you also to the media fire link so this one is 1.17 megabytes file this one is also you have to download press uh, download and then ok press on ok and it will appear here the little option to download the while you downloading finish it will appear a little option here to open the files so just wait for that uh, uh, option it can be fast because if your internet is fast mine will be slow so that's why it's taking time Okay, this option will appear as you can see down there and you have to click on that and uh, okay this one file is already downloaded so what I'm gonna do I think uh, I'm gonna download again that file the first application is didn't download so I'm gonna download it again because it's showing that is only download one and then again I'm gonna download that application and it will show you here once it's finished downloading So please guys don't forget to subscribe our channel if you like this video and uh, press open again and as you can see both application has been uh, downloaded now go to uh, go click on that application and then go to settings and uh, then go down there and unknown sources and turn it on and then press ok and then install this application. After all of this application, uh, install the second application, go to setting again and uh, turn it on and on sources and then press OK and then install. And uh, install this application too. Okay, after installing this application, op press open and click on these three dots on the corner and click on browse in and then press OK. And then here you can type your new email address uh, with the password that you have. I'm going to type mine. And uh, make sure that this is not my real email address, so don't email anything on this email. The first I put email address and second I put the password and then I'm going to press this button here. And then I'm going to sign in with this account. It will sign in, in as you can see, it will say take moment and down what you have to do after finish this. You just have to press the power button of your phone and restart this phone. And it will restart wait for the restart finished and now select start and then press next and then again press next and say accept again and wait for the checking connection something like that just wait a moment can take a while software updates and as you can see it's a account added your first account is ready to use and then you can do that next and then it will say just a second so it will take just a second so be patient
so i hope guys uh, you did enjoy this video and it uh, does help you so please don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the like button and share this video with your friends and uh, tell them to subscribe our channel so we can sub uh, we can bring you the videos most video more videos like this to help you guys okay as you can see it's just finished it can take up to two minutes guys so be patient then press next and uh, you say account and say not now then password uh, you can set it later skip it skip anyway and uh, just a second again and uh, don't restore uh, complete yeah then say next just keep all option if you want to set it you can set it i'm just gonna skip it for now and then say not now and finish okay as you can see we are in the menu my friends so thanks for watching so thanks for watching guys and uh, see you some other time with a new video so as you can see we are on the phone without any bypass account okay so give us thumbs up if you like this video and keep supporting us if it, this video helps you so see you some other time goodbye take care of yourself